How I earned 3000 from CG Traders alone. This is one of the special videos I've always wanted to make for a very long time but I couldn't for some reason. In this video, I will talk about my journey of selling 3D models on marketplaces like CG Trader, ArtStation and RenderHub. In this video, I will focus only on CG Trader and give you some tips on how you can put in a little effort and start earning immediately. On CG Trader, there are multiple ways to earn, not just one, from selling 3D models to working for clients or even working for CG Trader itself. I have been using CG Trader for more than 3 years now and I have earned around 3000 or more. Why I am saying 3000? Well, this is the income that was processed through CG Trader. But with it, I gained potential clients and work for them outside of this platform. So in my experience, I have earned more than 3k from this platform alone. Now I will divide the explanation into 3 sections. Selling 3D models, working on freelance projects, joining Wildcat and working for CG Trader directly. Selling 3D models on this platform has earned me about 80% of the total income. Interestingly, I never put too much effort into making these models. All these models are from my YouTube videos, personal work and models that I made as a daily practice. My biggest advice from this video is that everything sells, no matter what you make. Just put in a little effort to make it as clean as possible and put them on sale. Sooner or later, they will start generating some revenue. If I go to my public profile on CG Trader, you can see that I have a total of 93 models here, 32 reviews which I received from doing freelance projects, and some reviews from my 3D models that were sold. Third, here is an image gallery which I'll come back to later. But all these 3D models you see are barely in T pose or A pose. You can just put anything up for sale. They will eventually get a sale. The key is to present them well. Put as much effort into rendering as you do when creating the model. These models are already posed and I have specifically mentioned that these models are for rendering purpose only. And still people buy them. They buy them to study or use in their renders. Base meshes are also something you can sell. I have created a few of them and I got a decent sales from them. Base meshes are in demand. If you work on a good topology, the chance of selling them will increase. For me, I just made these blockouts in ZBrush and put them on sale and I start getting sales from them eventually. The key is to work hard at first and start selling as much as you can. The number of models on sales plays a significant role in your income. It's just math. People have uploaded thousands of models on this site and get sales of $100 daily. The second and one of the fastest way to earn money on CG Trader is by doing freelance projects. I have done quite a few and I can say for myself that the quality of client is way better than those you find on Fiverr and other freelancing sites. People take 3D modeling seriously here, whether you are a hard surface modeler or focus on character sculpting, whether it's for animation games or 3D printing, all kinds of clients come here. I did multiple projects using this platform and later I gained trust from the clients and they started giving me projects outside of CG Traders. This is why I said at the start of this video that I earn way more than this amount from this site. One criticism I have for this section is that it is too oversaturated. But like any other platform, demand is low and supply is very high. You have to be good at what you do to attract the attention of the person who is hiring. I can see 30 plus people applying for the same project but only one of them is selected. So work on your skills as much as you can. The third method to earn from this site is in the same niche but it's quite different. There is a section on CG Trader called Wildcat. Basically, you work for CG Trader instead of normal clients. I don't know how CG Trader gets projects but I think they take projects from potential clients and give them to freelance artists. The catch is that you have to get a proof in order to work for the Wildcat. As you can see here, there are two categories available at the moment, low poly and artist modeling. As for me, I am a character artist so I didn't see any value for myself and personally, I haven't used it. All these three patterns I told you about, you can start earning from any of them but the majority of the benefits come from selling 3D models. So start selling all your personal work that has been lying around for years. The key is to have them rendered well, good presentation is very important to attract clients whether it's a portfolio or selling 3D models. Another way to attract potential client is to upload your final renders on CG Trader Art Gallery. This platform has a huge art gallery and artists post their work daily. I got some clients from just posting my renders on this gallery. So be sure to check this section as well. I hope this video has been helpful to you. Please comment, like the video and subscribe to the channel if you haven't. If you saw my previous announcement, I am on a Patreon now. From giving away my ZBrush custom UI to sharing all of my 3D models, including my personal work. There are benefits to all these memberships. If you like my content, please join my Patreon so you can support for what I do. Until next time, I will see you on the next video.